Hey everybody, welcome to my channel and thanks for joining me in hotel quarantine. That's why my backdrop here is a little bit different and unfortunately it's kind of an ugly day outside. So it really doesn't make for the best backdrop but we're just going to roll with it. So I thought I would make a video showing some outfit ideas with clothes from some of my most recent hauls. I thought it would be a little bit more helpful than just a clothing haul so you can see how I would actually style some of these pieces. And some of the clothes I'm actually showing y'all today haven't been in any of my videos because it's just a few pieces that I couldn't really make a whole video with. So I'll be showing you some of those today. And the first outfit is actually the outfit I have on. This shirt is something I haven't shown y'all yet and these shorts actually are too. So both of these pieces are from Windsor and the shorts are actually a little bit lower on the waist than I thought they would be. But it's actually okay because the shirt goes down a little bit lower too. Normally if I'm wearing a crop top, I like my pants to be super high waisted, but since this one's a little bit longer, it still kind of hides things that you want hidden. <laughs> and I love these cute little sleeves. I feel like I'm in a fairy tale or something. The shirt is just so ditzy and girly and cute. And I don't have a lot of super girly pieces like this, so when I saw it, I knew I had to have it. And of course, it's sage green, which everybody is loving right now. And I like the nice floral print that it has on it too. And I love these shorts because they're a little bit longer. Definitely long enough in the back. I just feel really comfortable in these and I think they're super cute too. Alright, here's the second outfit that I've put together. Just a nice light wrap top with a little bralette under it and some really distressed jeans. So this whole outfit is from Windsor besides the bralette. And the outfit I showed you before is also from Windsor. I can't remember if I mentioned that or not. But I'll have all the clothes linked in the description box below as well as the size of all the clothes I'm wearing. I'll let you get a closer look at the top. It's a nice burnt orange color and it's very light. So even on really hot days, it's not gonna feel too hot. And these jeans are nice because since they're just so distressed and open, you'll feel a little breeze through the holes so you won't get too hot either. But it's also nice for those a little bit cooler days since it is still spring. I've paired this outfit with some sandals from Shein. And the first outfit I wore I also paired with these sandals. Most of the outfits I'm showing you today are either paired with these sandals or my Air Maxes because a lot of my shoes are still in my luggage since I'm not really wearing them around the hotel room. <laughs> but yeah, just a nice basic outfit that I think looks really cute. Okay, I love this outfit. It's my favorite color right now, which is lilac. I almost said lavender. And it's got a cute little tennis skirt with it. Disclaimer, this skirt is very see-through, so I just paired it with some slip shorts that I just got from Walmart for like $8, and now you can't see anything. And also, I wore this sweatshirt on the plane, which was a very long ride, and I tend to snack while I'm on the plane for 15 hours. So, I noticed right before the video that there are some chocolate stains. So I'm really sorry about that, but I really wanted to show you this sweatshirt anyway paired with this skirt. And it's such an effortless outfit, but it is so cute and so trendy and I'm in love. And I really hope the stain comes out of my sweatshirt. And both of these pieces were super affordable, but this is a nice piece for days that are just a little bit chillier. It's still technically spring, so you will have some of those colder days. But I just love this outfit. I can't wait to wear it when I'm out of quarantine. I think I'm wearing these shorts because you probably just saw my butt. Okay, sticking with the casual outfit category, I have this Razorback top. Racer? Razorback top? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. And some sweatpants. I've actually had these sweatpants for a while, but the top is new to me. It's from Windsor. And it has that cute um, ruching side detail. And since it is ruched and self-tie, you can make it as short or long as you want. I just realized this tie is starting to come undone. Let me tie that back up. And a top like this, you can really dress up or down, but I just really like the baby pink with my gray sweatpants. This is another very simple outfit idea. I'm not doing anything groundbreaking, but I just wanted to show you some of my pieces and how I would style them. And I think this is another cute outfit. By the way, I changed spots because it was getting way too dark over there by the window, so that's why I'm over here now. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this outfit even more with the pink clip that I got from Amazon. I got a pack of four clips and my hair up in a clip just matches the style of the outfit so well and I think it really just pulls it together. I like the pack of clips that I got from Amazon too. It came with a pink, green, like a beigey color and black. I just love it. Y'all, I love this top. It is so simple but it is so cute. I love this asymmetrical one shoulder detail. Um, I definitely have a bra on with it so if you can see it I'm sorry. I'll probably normally just wear Pacey's with this but I just kept the bra on so anyway i love the beige everybody's loving beige right now it's ribbed here let me get a little closer 
sorry about the bra. So it's like a ribbed slinky material. It's very thin, but it is not see-through at all. It's very soft and light. It'll be perfect for really hot days in the summer. And these pants are really cute too. I actually got these from Forever 21 like two years ago. So I'm not sure if they'll still be in stock, but I'll try to find something similar to link down below. But I just think it goes really well with this top, the distress and the fact that they're like mom jeans and not super tight. I just like that look with a really tight short crop top and then a little bit baggier pants. They don't look super baggy up here, but they loosen up a little bit at the bottom. But even baggier pants than this with a pair of Air Forces will look so cute. This is just a super trendy outfit, super simple, very affordable, and I think it would look great on so many people. And also I have a jacket that would look really cute with this. It's actually a shacket, and it's still in my carry-on bag. I put like five of my jackets in one of those like vacuum sealed bags to go on my carry-on because it doesn't matter how heavy it is. But since it's vacuum sealed, I think that's what it's called, if I open it up, it's not going to fit back in my carry-on and I do have to leave the hotel to get back to the house. So I'll show you a picture of it from one of my other videos and I'll link it down in the description box below also. But it would look really cute with this top and these jeans if it was a little bit colder. Okay, so you can probably tell that I really like purple with white together. I just think the colors complement each other so well. I was really struggling to get this top tied but this is the best I could come up with. I just couldn't do it today. And this is what the back looks like. This is actually not the way you're supposed to tie it, but I think it looks a little bit better on me than how it was intended to be tied. This is just a very sweet and girly outfit, but you could easily pair this top with something else and make a really sexy outfit. So these pants are actually from a year ago from a website in Australia. So I might not be able to link these exact pairs, but I know Shein has a lot of stuff like this on their website, so I'll try to link something similar. <sighs> Wine break also have this outfit paired with those sandals from Shein. I think it goes really well with it. And I love that I'm pairing all of these outfits with just two pairs of shoes. It shows you how versatile a white pair of shoes are. Okay, next outfit. So normally with a skirt like this, I would wear a crop top just to break it up a little bit. But I think I really like this bodysuit with this skirt. And I love the open back of the bodysuit. I'm actually going to keep my hair in front of my boobs because I don't have any pasties on right now and apparently it's a lot colder in here than I thought. <laughs> so let's just cover those up. Okay, so this skirt, Shocker, is from last year. But again, Shein has so many skirts like this, so I will link something similar. And I have those slip shorts on again because if I just had the bodysuit under this, you would probably see the lines in the back because it's not double lined. You can really dress this look up with some high heels. I think some strappy heels look really cute with this. Or you can just wear those sandals that I've already shown you. I feel like this is kind of like a classier outfit. I don't know. I feel like Audrey Hepburn in this. Pretty cute. I actually had another shirt I was thinking about wearing with this. So I might show it to you real quick. It's another older piece, but again, Shein has everything so you can find something very similar. So let me show you real quick. So this is another option you could wear with this skirt. I think I actually like this shirt a lot better. Just so many cute options with a skirt like this. I love it. I just feel like doing this. Okay, this is another fun flirty outfit. I feel like this skirt makes it a little bit girlier. A nice basic denim skirt can go with so many outfits. And I love this top. I love the color and I love that it's tie-dye. And it has that stitching detail where it's coming off of the shirt. The shirt is really soft and even though it has long sleeves, it's a very thin shirt. So you won't get super hot in it, but it will keep you warm if it's a little bit chilly. And like I said, it's thin, but it's not see-through at all. At least not with a new bra. I would probably pair this outfit with those white sandals, but you could also wear some little white sneakers and it would look pretty cute with it too. Oh, I think it's time for another wine break. Speaking of wine, I feel like this is a cute like vineyard outfit to go take pictures. Okay, I have another super casual outfit with just a really cute top. I love the circle tie detail right there. It's very cute. And you could even untie it if you want the circle to be a little bit bigger or smaller. You can kind of customize it to however you want. Again, I love the color beige and I love tie-dye. So when I saw this, I knew I had to have it. And the shirt's really, really soft. It's so comfortable. And it's a nice thin shirt that you can wear in summer and not sweat your butt off. I think this shirt would also look really cute paired with some high-waisted shorts too. You have a lot of options with this shirt since it's so casual. Okay, this is the last outfit of the video. You know, I had to throw in one more lilac piece. 
And fun fact, my leggings are actually damp because I have to hand wash all of my dirty clothes in hotel quarantine. Love that. They haven't completely dried yet, but I wanted to show you anyway because I think this outfit's really cute. And I have to be quick because my camera's about to die any second now. But this is one of my favorite gym outfits and it's something you can just throw on to go hang out with friends or get some groceries. And I love this oversized jacket with it. It's actually a Hanes jacket from Amazon. It was like $12 and they have a bunch of different colors. I'm definitely getting another color in this jacket. So my camera did die. And while I was charging, I just put this top on so it was a little bit less revealing if you don't just like wearing sports bras around. And I like that you can kind of see the design through it. It just adds a little bit to a basic top like this. And these leggings are actually really comfortable. They're not that same like silky material. They're actually a little bit more cottony. And that cotton material kind of scares me with leggings because I feel like whenever you start sweating, you'll see the sweat, but you can't with these leggings. They are sweat proof and squat proof and just overall really cute. Okay, that was all the outfits I had to show y'all. I really hope y'all liked the video and please comment down below which outfit was your favorite. And if you like this video, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more videos like this. And you can hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every time I have a new video. Thanks so much for watching guys. It really means a lot to me and I'll see y'all next time.